When it comes to the Babyliss foil shavers, do you think the metal is the most powerful? Do you think the FX3 is the most powerful? Or do you think the UV is the most powerful? So box shavers have obviously been around for a while. Every company has their own sets, uh, different features. What I like about the Babyliss ones is this sturdy cap. For a long time when I first started out, um, when I was using other companies' foil shavers, they had a super plasticky top that would kind of fly off, especially if I'm packing up and I have to do a house call or anything like that. One of the first things I remember seeing was this metal cap that really secures it and locks it. None of this ever flies off in my bag, which is super nice, especially because these foils in here are very sensitive. So they can break really easily. So making sure that this Thing doesn't pop off is very important to us. This obviously has a good weight to it. If you are familiar with any of the metal, this is just the pink custom version. Um, these are heavier, so some people would describe it as more sturdy in their hands. Um, they like the weight because it feels like you have a little bit uh, of a weighted push when you're using the tool, so that could also be a thing. And then for those who are like me and like something a lot lighter, uh, when the FX3 came out with their set, this was incredible because this one's not a metal body. This is gonna be more of like this fiberglass kind of material. Super sleek because it's not shiny at all. It's more of that matte black finish. And what I like about this one is that it's super lightweight, especially for long day use. Uh, this is definitely a go-to that I would recommend. This is the FX3. Again, you have your four LED indicators here. Okay, but is it the strongest? It might get passed up because Something new that came out not too long ago was the UV foil shavers. And you guys may have seen that it comes in a double and it comes in a single. You get 10,000 RPMs, which is similar to the FX3, 10,000 RPMs. But what makes this one a little bit more powerful than that one, the only thing you gotta think about is that this one is a little heavier. So when I'm using this, this is feeling more like this one. But again, I love the sturdy cap. And with the UV foil shaver, for those of you who don't know what this is, so let's just open this up really quick. So what makes this a UV uh, special, when you turn it upside down, there's a UV A and B light that go together and disinfect your foil. So as you put this on top, so in between clients, like. Obviously, I'm still gonna spray my disinfectant spray. It's just a must have. You really can just not skip it. But for added protection, you have this new UV cap here. Once I put this on, it turns blue and it's gonna cycle and disinfect that foil. So that is a cool feature with the whole UV system. Um, I love that. And I, I can only imagine that we're gonna be adding some more of this type of technology to maybe our clippers and trimmers. Going back to the foil power. When you open this up, because it's only a single foil, you actually have a stronger 10,000 RPM because it's only running off of one foil versus the other one, you're splitting it between two, making this the most powerful and also easier to refine your work because you only have this single side to maneuver in all the areas that you need. Definitely worth checking out if you're looking for a new foil shaver, UV. This UV one is super sick.